What is up guys, Mr. The Reverts here and today I want to show you guys how to repair armor in Blackout Battle Royale. Now this is one of the new core game mechanic features that was added in today's update for December the 10th and some of you guys may not know how to do this when you play your first game after downloading so hopefully this video does help you out and you won't be confused. So basically every piece of armor will have these blue squares and these blue squares indicate the amount of health the armor has. Level 1 has a total of 500 level 2 has 600 and level 3 has 800 so depending on where the armor square is at dictates how much health it has in terms of 100 so um, 800 again that's going to be eight squares level 2 is going to have six squares and level 1 is going to have five squares so in the gameplay here my level 1 armor is about maxed out at 500 but then I'm going to have my teammate shoot me and it'll drop my armor down to about 300 now here is how you repair the armor so you need to scavenge and loot these armor plates you can find them a lot off of looting or by killing someone who already has armor and then for every piece you use to repair it's going to give you 100 or a square total and you can hold a max of 10 armor plates so for example let's say I have my level 3 armor set to 100 or 1 square and then I have 7 armor plates in my inventory and then I'm going to use those 7 plates and it'll fully restore my level 3 armor like it was not even damaged before. It does take 2 seconds to fully repair your armor so um, going back to the same example I have 7 plates. It's going to take 14 seconds to fully restore that level 3 armor back so that's where you have to kind of get to a hidden location, go somewhere safe and then repair your armor. Don't do it wide out in the open and so yeah that's just my little tip that I have have also whenever you come across a armor plate always 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 pick it up because later on in the game you're gonna have armor or if you don't already then you will need to repair it once you get into a gunfight so always pick up a armor plate off the ground always loot an armor plate if you see one in a body bag and uh, so yeah that's my little tips that I have so far guys I love this armor update I think it adds a lot more strategy into the game it definitely pushes players to go out and loot more instead of camping and playing tactically because if you get into a long gun fight or you come up behind someone or you're even camping and someone happens to run across you and then you kill them but you don't want to loot because they, their body bags may be out in the corner well it does kind of push campers to go out and loot because if they already have damaged armor then they can go out and you know repair their armor better so instead of hugging the wall it definitely does push his players to play more aggressively and that's why I love this update more but Tell me your thoughts about this down below in the comments, guys. That's just my basic guide of how to repair armor. We do have a lot more fun stuff coming out tomorrow with Hijacked and, of course, the new vehicle. The two new guns, the SWAT and then the uh, Daemon are already out for blackouts. So if you guys haven't used them, they're pretty common. The Daemon just shreds, man. I'm going to have a video coming out later today talking about that as well. And yeah, just a lot of fun stuff for Blackout, guys. But tell me your thoughts about it down below in the comments. Thanks for watching. Till next time, I'll see you guys later.